All right, people. <clears throat> so this is going to be quick. It's not going to be an in-depth type thing. I'm not going to break everything down. Um, you know, I'm getting ready to do a video later on today. I got a guest going to have on. So I'm getting ready for that. But I wanted to um, at least share my opinion on the topic because it involves my favorite Major League Baseball team uh, in the Cleveland Indians. Um, so, yeah, trade last night. There was speculation of a trade uh, in the future. Not really certain when or how or who. Um, but there's been speculation on Trevor Bauer getting traded. Now, Trevor Bauer, just to keep this quick, because I, I got a lot to do. I don't want to go deep in depth. But he's a star pitcher for the Indians. Great player. Uh, dependable guy. Star in the league. Love to have him on my team. You know, he had an issue where he threw the baseball, got frustrated, threw it into the stands or into the outfield. It was weird. He kind of just turned around and chucked it, which was a bad look because when you're frustrated like that in any sport, you can't make stupid decisions like that. And yes, I know with Odo Beckham Jr., he did stuff like that. I know. But I'm saying that's not a great look for him to do that. Uh, and that goes for anybody. But as far as the trade, the two major factors in this trade are the Indians trade Trevor Bauer to the Reds, and the Indians are getting Yasiel Puig. Now, Puig is a guy who I really like. I think he's, I, I think he's a lot better than people think he is. Um, now, I'm not saying that he's the best in the league or anything like that, but I do think he is a really good player. Um, and there was a couple other pieces with this trade that was really nice, but just to keep it short, um, as much as I would like to keep Trevor Bauer, I, I had a feeling that this trade was coming sooner than later. A trade was coming, rather, maybe not this trade. But as far as what we get for him, I think I, here's here's my take. Am I mad that he's off? I'm, am I frustrated that he's not an Indian anymore? Yes, he's a great player. But what we got for him in return, I'm not mad about. I'm not. Because I'm glad that we got somebody of the talent of Yasiel Puig for Trevor Bauer. You know, I, I wasn't expecting anything huge back for him. But I think that... I think Puig is a guy who softens the blow of losing Trevor Bauer, um, if you know what I mean. We got Kluber. I mean, we're starting to come back around, but I don't know. I... Basically, all I'm trying to say is, am I saying that we won this trade? Am I saying that we're set up for the next five years? No, I'm not. I'm just simply saying he was going to get traded. This has been speculated for a long time. Trade deadline's coming up soon. Um, so... There was speculation he was going to get traded. I expected him to get traded. So what we got in return for him, I'm happy with. So, yeah, there's a quick reaction, if you will, to this trade that came down last night. So, I mean, I don't, I'm not the most, um, I don't watch all the games of the Indians because there's a lot of games in baseball and there's a lot of stuff going on so but as far as team news and in general i felt like this i need to do something on this on this trade so um let me know your opinion on this there's i did talk to one of my friends he was he said it was a horrible deal um 
very frustrated, very upset. Um, you know, and I understand that I really do, but I think in the end, I think he was gone. I think it was going to leave regardless. Um, so what we got for him, I'm not upset. So with that being said, look forward to the video coming out soon, soonish, later today. Um, so yeah, let me know your thoughts on this. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, turn on your notifications, tell me what you thought, and we will see you in the next video. Bye.